nine MC. I, I mean, I I've only actually been teaching three years, and um, they were they were my form um, that they started school. I started teaching, and I think when you've got a situation like that where you you grow up with them, um, it kind of instills this mutual respect that can't that can't just be made overnight. Uh, a lot of work has gone into um, the respect that they now have for me, just through um, us growing together. Um, one thing that I say to them always is I, I don't do chaos. I, I like to, to keep things calm at all times. Um, one of the things that, that will often happen as a form tutor is your tutees will look to you to help them um, with their schoolwork, with their personal lives as well. I mean, I, I think a lot of the, the members of the form see me as like a, a, a cool best mate that's like a bit older. Sis, can you help us with this? Oh, of course, yeah. What is it? It makes mass, but we never... Oh, easy, yeah. Um, which one? Yeah, that one. Two times seven. No when they come to me with like a science problem, a history problem, maths, and any subject, I can do them all. Yeah, I know. It's easy. Dead easy. Yeah, I will help if you actually tell me which one it is. Oh, well, you should be doing homework in lessons then, shouldn't you? Oh, detention! You should be doing your homework in lessons, girls. Um, one of the really um, big pressure points of this year um, in year nine was uh, the options. Um, you know, they had to choose what, what options they were going to do at GCSE and that's obviously massively important because it effectively dictates what they're going to be doing with the rest of their lives. I mean, um, some students have said to me, oh, sir, I don't really know what I want to do yet. I say, no, you, you must know exactly what you want to do. Um, and I, I try to force, uh, uh, make, you know, encourage them to pick um, subjects that will help them on their journey through life. Um, I try to instil in them a sense of aspiration, uh, ambition. So you thought about what well, you might do? I was thinking about becoming an author because then I could just like sit at home and I'll be writing. No, you don't do that, that's a terrible idea. And just basically give them the message that you can be whatever you want to be in life. Have you thought about anything else? I mean, something more suited to your skills, like, uh, you know, like Bramble Picker or something? Well, I was thinking about working at McDonald's. Yeah, I mean, I mean that's, that's, that's the kind of thing I'm talking about. I mean, we, we need to pick things that are, you know, aspirational, but also realistic as well. Yeah. What are you thinking of doing for your options? Oh, well, I thought I'd be an assassin, you know? What do you yeah. think I need to do that, though? One of the things that you kind of have to wrangle with a bit in uh, year nine, you know, they start to push the boundaries, and I've noticed a big problem has been makeup, um, and they they really want to see what they can get away with, and I, as a professional, have got a role to ensure that they're following the school rules, you know, conforming to what we expect of them um, at Highfield School, and that does actually involves some really awkward conversations where I have to kind of lay down the law and uh, you know tell them how it is and they, they don't always like that but I think they respect it. This makeup thing is a real problem now. I've spoken to Miss Ruston and she says nail varnish, lipstick, it's just not allowed and you know that and you've put me in an awkward position because now I've got to tell you about it. What do you have to say for yourselves? I'm, I'm really sorry. 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 It's never I think ultimately um, when I think about the the journey I've had um, over these last three years with 9MC, um, it truly is a privilege um, to be able to, to work with these students. Um, they're great. Cool. Brilliant. Cheers. <coughs> is that everything? Uh, well, should we get some of the year nines in? What? Get a bit to camera from the year nines. Uh, no, they're idiots. <laughs>